as a parent, you obviously want your child to thrive in this world. And this is normally more likely to happen if your child has a decent IQ. Well, not always, but, but most of the times. <laughs> anyway, so logically you ask yourself, is my baby intelligent? Yes. So in this video, we are going to discuss the 10 signs that your baby is intelligent. Yes. This is Natalie, a pregnancy and birth consultant, TCM therapist. And that's Matthias, a researcher and science geek. Can we help expecting mummies and their babies naturally and science-based? Yes. So how can you tell if your baby is intellectually gifted? Alright, so first of all, please note that even if your baby is super intelligent, it does not necessarily mean that you're going to see all of the signs that we're about to discuss. Yeah. It could also only just be one of them. Right? Exactly. On the other hand, if your baby does not show any of the signs that we are about to discuss, it does not mean that your baby is dumb, okay? Yes, we, we don't want you to leave this video and, and think, oh my god, my baby is so dumb. Yeah. That would be the wrong conclusion. Right. right? Besides, giftedness could also only show later on. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so the first sign that your baby is intelligent, according to research, is when your baby tends to be very alert and awake. You know, some babies seem so interested in what happens around them. Mm. They always look around and they seem to pay attention to everything they see. Yeah. Well, actually, not only what they see, but also what they hear and smell, mm. right? Particularly initially, as long as their vision is still limited. Exactly. They have a genuine interest in their environment. They are good observers and they pay attention to details, also when they become older, by the way. Yeah. For example, your preschooler may suddenly talk about things they observed. The woman I saw today was wearing a red dress. Or the man was carrying a big suitcase. They observe and recognize things on their own without you having to make them aware of things. Yes, and they do that on a continuous basis. Mm. In other words, they seek constant stimulation of their mind, yeah. which is the next sign of an intelligent baby. They want to be carried around. Mm. They want you to play the clown for them because <laughs> it stimulates their mind. Yeah. And by the way, such babies also tend to be more fussy than other babies. Because just imagine you're a smart little baby, you cannot yet move that much and you spend most of the time on your back observing the ceiling, right? <laughs> what are you going to do? Well, you're going to fast the <laughs> out of your parents until they do not even dare to think about not entertaining you anymore. Right? Exactly. The same also applies when they become older, of course. They want to be entertained. But not in the same way over and over again. You constantly have to think about new ways to entertain yeah. your child. They need that stimulation. And because of that stimulation, such children and babies in particular are also more likely to sleep less than other babies, which can be another sign that your baby is intelligent. Yes, because they seek constant stimulation, they also keep processing those stimuli in their mind at night, mm. which is why they may not sleep well at times. Mm -hmm. So next time when you spend most of the time entertaining your baby rather than sleep, don't forget that you could raise a future Einstein. So that's that. Now another sign that the baby is intelligent is a good memory. Yes. So for example, if you hide a toy from a baby, let's say under a pillow, then some babies will know exactly where that toy was hidden. And the same applies to preschoolers, by the way. Yeah. Try to play matching pairs with a preschooler. You will often be surprised how they outperform you in that game, mm -hmm. even at such a young age. Exactly. They may also be able to easily memorize things they learned. For example, things they learned at the nursery mm -hmm. or in a video, etc. Mm -hmm. Or they may memorize a story that they read to them. Yeah. And they're also most likely good in recognizing faces even at a young age. Exactly. Right? Another sign of intelligence is when your baby is able to connect the dots. For example, let's say your baby is playing with a toy that requires baby to insert a little ball on one end so that it comes out on the other end of the toy. If a baby already expects that ball to come out on the other end before it even has, then your baby is able to connect the dots. Yes, they understand that the result of inserting the ball on the one end makes it come out on the other end. That is a sign of intelligence, mm. right? Mm -hmm. Now, uh, next to the signs of intelligence that we just discussed, scientists also found that gifted babies often show a certain behavior that you may not intuitively link to intelligence. So first of all, it was found that intelligent babies normally have a strong need for emotional support. Yes. So if your infant wants to be carried around all the time, it can either be because they look for that stimulation of their mind 
or because they need your emotional support. But both can be signs of an intelligent baby. Yes, and even more so in older children. Gifted children are often emotionally quite sensitive. Mm. Their feelings can easily get hurt, yeah. right? And that sensitivity is not limited to their own person. They also tend to be quite empathic when it comes to other people, which can be another sign of intelligence. Yes, for example, they may feel for another child who is crying. Or maybe your child does not want you to squash that spider, etc. They feel for others, right? Yeah. Of course, this is a character trait that is more easily to detect in older children than in infants. It's difficult to detect empathy in infants. Yes, that's right. But even in babies, like uh, for example, you may observe that your baby is sharing their toy with another baby who is crying, right? So to some degree, you can even observe empathy in babies, mm -hmm. right? So in general, the emotional side seems to play a big role in intelligent babies, but it also seems that that sensitivity is not limited to emotions. Exactly. As summarized in a great article from Very Well, according to research, it can also be a sign of an intelligent baby when baby is hypersensitive to sounds, smells, textures and tastes. In particular, they may strongly react to unpleasant ones. Exactly. So maybe your baby, and of course it also applies to older kids, shows a particularly strong reaction to certain sounds or smells or tastes, particularly to unpleasant ones, mm -hmm. right? It could be a sign of intelligence according to research. And talking about sounds, another sign of intelligence in babies is when they are able to mimic sounds. So do observe your baby, make some sound and see if your baby mimics that sound. Exactly. And a final sign of intelligence in babies can be when they reach milestones in their development, such as crawling, earlier than the average baby. That said, we want to point out that while this was observed in gifted babies, it does not mean at all that a gifted baby will always reach such developmental milestones earlier than their peers, okay? Yes, and we also want to point out that even gifted babies may be behind uh, compared to other babies mm. when it comes to certain developmental aspects. However, eventually, they often quickly catch up. Yes. Now, the question we often hear is, is there anything that I can do while I'm still pregnant to make my baby smarter? The answer is yes, there is. And we show you what to do in the video that hopefully pops up now. Yes. And then one of the most important things to do to actually support your baby's brain development after baby was born is breastfeeding, mm -hmm. particularly if you breastfeed your baby for a longer period of time. Yeah. We show you how long it is recommended to breastfeeding a baby in the video that is supposed to pop up now. Right. If you have found this video helpful, we would be super grateful if you could leave us a like below this video. Yes, and for more useful tips and tools on pregnancy and baby related topics, make sure to subscribe to our channel and to hit the bell. <laughs>